Ladies and gentlemen, this video is scheduled for another haul. Introducing to you today, your host for Wrestling With Beauty, the broke beauty guru, the ring queen, Lexa Rose. can't do my clap my hands are full um okay so of course another sheen haul i did this because of the viral tiktok crop top that i've been seeing if you haven't seen my tiktoks on that go watch them but i got a couple of other nice little items like some shorts and some skirts so we're gonna just try on everything and i will give you my final thoughts and my review on this sheen haul Okay, so if you don't know what this is, this is the viral TikTok crop top that's been like popping up on my For You page, and I decided to pick one up. This is a 2XL, as you can tell, and... Ah! Oh All right, well, I don't know if you can see the skirt. I'm going to push it back so you can see it. Okay, so this is the skirt that I got. It's floor length. It goes all the way to the floor, which is nice. It covers up my feet just enough. Um, I like the way it fits. Like if I suck it in, I got that little thing right there. But once I'm like full gut, right. Ah! He needs some milk. Pero I like it. Gotta be careful with these though. <laughs> We don't want the children to come out to play, right? So, you know, we're just gonna kind of like pinch and pull back. There we go. And this one too. You know, just make them look even-ish, okay? Because you can't even say the, the twins, they're sisters. <laughs> they're sisters, okay? So, uh, yeah, just so you know, you know, like, but it's a cute top. You can't go too crazy in it, um, mainly because, uh, I mean, it does support. It has the underwire to kind of like, you know, keep them kind of scoop, but I like it. I also have another version of the top uh, that I got in the 2XL, and I also got one in a 1XL to see how it fits, but it seems as though the 2XL is fitting really nicely. So um, we're going to try on the two pairs of shorts with the other top and go into the other bang of stuff that I got okay so if you're seeing this top it was from my last sheen haul that I did um, but I got these shorts that magically go with them so yeah he needs some milk I like this outfit. I just gotta fix up the boobage area because it's a little too big for my taste. I should have gotten a size smaller. Um, when it comes to tops, it's really, really weird depending on what you're getting. So you kind of have to use your own judgment on which size you want to get. I should have gotten an extra large instead of a 2XL, but it's fixable. She can be fixed and she matches with the fit. Okay? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You can't see all of it, but. Yeah, I'm gonna be looking cute this summer. Let's go on with the new the next one. This is another pair of shorts, I believe. Um, and I also got another one of the iconic uh viral shirts. Is this a skirt? Oh no, this is a skirt. Alright, so this is another skirt. Um we're gonna just try it on with this top, so I will be right back. Okay, so I kept the top on. I really wish you could see the skirt, it is so pretty. And it's very, very kind of flowy. It kind of opens up a lot. And it's in black. I like it that it's a, a heavy kind of fabric, but still light enough that you can kind of feel pretty. And I feel poor, I, I feel hella Puerto Rican with this dress. I should have gotten it in white. Like, dead ass. This is... Aha! Me gusta. He needs some 
some milk. I'm feeling it. All right. So now that we've tried everything on in this bag, we still have one more top, but I've got a couple of more uh, shorts in the next bag. So we're just going to open that one up and just try them on with this top, okay? Okay, so what I did was, um, this is the 2XL version of this top. And since I already tried on the 2XL version, I'm pretty sure you don't need to see what this pattern looks like on these boobs. So I am wearing the 1XL version and I think it personally fits my boobs better. And I should have gotten it in the 1XL. I don't know why I was playing myself like that, you know? Pero at least I got two in a normal size for me, which they still fit as a 2XL. But this 1XL just, and it goes with the shorts too, look. Like, these shorts are really cute. These are the runched shorts. Um, hold on, let me pull them up because they're supposed to be like kind of runched right at the booty section. But we all know that uh, this girl got a fat old booty. So, uh, he needs some milk. decent shorts for the summer that actually kind of I don't know if you noticed but <laughs> cover up the thigh part most important part because you know thighs rub together create bacon smell and stuff you don't want that you don't want that okay so now what we're gonna do is entonces we're gonna take the other pair of shorts and we're gonna try these on too to see how they look now these are of course the viral scrunch pants but i got them in shorts form just to see how they would look so we're gonna put these on real quick see how they look and i'm gonna give you my thoughts okay so they're a little more high-waisted than i expected them to be but i'm not mad about that it's the back part that i want to know looks good he needs some milk I like these. I'm so happy that I finally found a company that has good clothes where they fit me really, really good. They feel really, really amazing. Like, I'm totally, totally in love with this. Like, just this whole outfit right here. Like, I'll go to the gas station in this shit. I don't give a damn. <laughs> Once we walk up in that gas station, like, hola, let me get a pack of Newports and a Red Bull. Ya tu sabe, okay? Y'all know me, my Puerto Rican roots. But we've got two more items and they're both skirts. So now that we got a good angle where you can see everything, you're gonna be able to see the other two skirts that I purchased. And I'm going to wear them with this top to see how they go with the tops. Because I got them for other tops that are real cute crop tops and stuff like that. But I'm, I'm really liking the way this, this one fits because it's a 1XL. And you would think because it's a 1XL, it's not going to fit me appropriately. But coño, coño, look at this. Look at this. I feel, <sighs> son of prince. <laughs> Lord, he's rolling his grave right now over that comment. <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyways, let's go into the next two skirts. I just come to realize that shirts like these help point out which titty is bigger than the other. Like, it, it really does remind you that your titties aren't twins. They're sisters. Okay, because they're... Yeah. Anyways, this is one of the other skirts that I got. Smooth back here so you can see it. It's also another floor length, but I love the little um, sparklies. It's two layers. The top part is like a lace kind of tool layer. And then the bottom is kind of just your 
generic satin layer underneath, but this is really nice and perfect for any time, basically. Like, I could wear this in the wintertime, and, you know, as long as I'm, like, warm wearing leggings underneath, I'll be Gucci Gucci. You know what I'm saying? But all. He needs some milk! I like this. I like this. And you know what's really funny? Um, I'm going to keep it real with you. We're going to have a little real moment. You know, you and I moment. Let's speak. I was fat shamed when I first started in the wrestling business because of some, of course you know the controversy. You've seen the video, right? Um, I had been always dealing with body dysmorphia. I've always felt self-conscious about my body even when I was at my skinniest so you know I, I kind of battled eating disorders growing up and once I met my husband I stopped battling them because it just got to a point where it was just like I'm big like when he met me I was big then I lost weight and then that's when um we started dating and then at that point even after everything that we had gone through he still loved me he still stayed with me he still wanted to marry me and at that point, I just kind of, you know, gained the weight, no Fs given, and he has loved me ever since. I already sent him a picture of me in this bad boy, and he's just like, mm, mm yes, girl, okay? Um, someone also uh, suggested that I wear this for my um, adult page, and uh, I might do that. I'd have to charge you for the shirt because the shirt isn't cheap. I mean, it isn't expensive, but if I want to be wasting one of these good-ass shirts, Ooh. show me the money. But anyways, I feel now more comfortable in my own skin than I ever did growing up, and I want to be able to inspire other people to feel comfortable in their skin. It's okay if you got stretch marks. Uh, skill seal. Look at me and my granny panties. You know, I've got stretch marks everywhere. This this is a sign of my son's, um, uh, you know, occupation in this apartment. Okay? Very, very proud of my tiger stripes. Very proud of it. Um, I'm proud of the chunks. I'm, I love it because look at this. Look at this. I didn't have these when I was skinny. Like, th this. This. Yeah, no, 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 no. If I have to deal with this, it's so worth it for this and this. It's definitely worth it. Um, so I just want to encourage you people to, you know, not take, not not be so hard on yourself if you're trying to lose weight or you're trying to be healthy. You know, that's great. Um, moderate yourself. Don't overdo it. Um, you know, don't always count calories. Just, you know, work out to work out. Not because you're counting calories or because you're worried about what somebody else thinks. Do it for you. If you want to stay big, then stay big. There's nobody else telling you that you can't be, uh, you know, big and beautiful. I mean, seriously. Look at this. Look at this. I'm fucking gorgeous. And you are too. So with that being said, we're going to try on the last skirt. And then we're going to go with my final thoughts and review, okay? Okay, so this one's just a little too tight. I don't know if you noticed that little, yeah, that dip right there. But it's fine. Um, I love the shimmer. This is the shimmer. It's gorgeous. Look at this. Look at the shimmer. And then, ah, and she flew away like a pink bat into the night. Bruh. If you haven't watched any John Leguizamo comedy specials, look them up <laughs> and look up ah! the German. He needs some milk! Ah! Toasty! But oh, I like it. I like the shimmer. I like the pink. I like the gold little goldish, lightish, ivory kind of shimmer to it. It's real cute. It's nice and short. It's not long like the other ones. So this is something that I can wear in the summertime in my bikini, feeling all cute and, and beautiful. Yeah. But, like, this top is trouble. <laughs> this top is... <sighs> Imagine me going to... I shudder to think the reactions I'll get if I go to my local gas station in this bad boy, like... <laughs> <sighs> he needs 
some milk. He oh, needs God. some milk. But um, let me change out of this stuff and put on something comfortable, and I'm gonna give you guys my final thoughts. Okay, so as you can tell, I loved everything. This is just a regular dress that it has. My bata, um, aka my nightgown or my sundress. I don't know what. what Whatever you call it, this is what this is, okay? I just call it my bata. Okay? Um, pero, I love the outfits. I absolutely love them. Again, that skirt was just a little too tight right here, but, again, no worries, no stress. Still came out good. Still looked good on me. Still fit decently. So, I'm not mad about it. Um, but the viral tops... Let me tell you, um, wasn't expecting that. Um, there's a lot of things that I've been learning this past year. Okay, let me just tell you that for a fact. This pandemic has taught me a lot. It has taught me that I can twerk and that my booty can move the tingles quite enticingly. I didn't know I could do that. Um, I also learned to love the skin I'm in. I learned to embrace my big and boldness i've learned to embrace this big old belly because you know what it's a price to pay for these big bazungas and this big baduka so i'm happy i'm happy i'm grateful i'm blessed and despite the fact that i had lost my job in the same year that i was graduating during a pandemic right after i got married i've kind of become more accepting of who i am i've become more accepting of myself and I become more confident in the skin that I that I'm in right now um I was struggling a lot with my weight and with the way I looked I didn't like the way I looked and I look at videos and pictures of myself when I was skinny and I don't like it I look drawn out I look dehydrated I look very old I look very withered and I didn't like it I, I like being big I like being chunky and fluffy and and filling out my skin I feel more confident being bigger and I hope to inspire other women who are my size to do the same and accept yourself and love yourself and if you don't like the way that you look you can always fix that if you want to go to the gym go to the gym find a buddy most importantly because you can't just go to the gym by yourself I'm sorry I trust me I worked at a gym and it was awkward seeing people come in by themselves work out and be so self-conscious that they barely do anything and then they walk out. And sometimes they'll come in late at night because they know that there isn't that many people. So again, um, I want to just inspire people to be more confident in their skin, to be more confident in who they are, and to stand up for themselves and stand up for being who you are and accepting who you are and most importantly, loving yourself. Because as RuPaul said, if you can't love yourself, how the hell are you going to love somebody else? It starts in here. And I want people to be able to know that and understand that and be able to feel that um, with my videos. I want people to love the energy that I give out. And I want people to feel that energy. And I want people to always be inspired to do what they want to do, to try new things, to try fun things, and to be beautiful and bold inside and out. So um, with that said, I love the clothes that I got from Sheen. I love the way they fit me. They made me feel so gorgeous. They made me feel so sexy. And I know my husband's going to love seeing me in all these outfits anyways. But... I took the bullet so that you don't have to. And with that being said, I hope that you do try out Sheen. They have wonderful stuff, especially for us curvy ladies. So don't feel, don't be afraid to, you know, purchase clothes from them. But when it comes to the tops, purchase some, uh, purchase around your size range. Like my waist is a two XL, but my bust apparently is only a one XL. So um, again, just kind of use your better judgment and your own discretion when ordering certain things of certain sizes. Um, with that being said, don't forget to pick up my novel, The Pure Blood Eternal, available on Amazon Books. And I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to hit the bell notification so you can find out when we have new videos, which is every Monday at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm your host for Wrestling With Beauty, the broke beauty guru, the ring queen, Lexa Rose, saying, keep it Gucci Poochie, bitches.